Hello guys, this is Vaish. So we'll discuss what is important of importance of August 19th uh, in history. Okay, so before that, uh, the Spectrum. Okay, Spectrum lecture, which is one of the most viewed uh, playlist also at Vaisha Yes, that uh, you have to go and watch because today, August 19th, is actually Afghan's Independence Day. Okay, Afghan Independence Day, even though in present context it doesn't have any significance, it is uh, under Taliban rule. But uh, you know. Uh, uh, the history okay how afghanistan was once under british or british tried to capture it that complete story is there in my spectrum you can search vaisha spectrum on youtube and you will uh, get uh, this thing okay you will get the uh, spectrum playlist in which the chapter 4 part number 3 is where uh, it is explained okay so the full thing is there in notes format and also in vaish courses channel when the Taliban took over in 2021, they took over Afghanistan. We had uh, put out a story, 4,000 years of Afghan history. So this also you can go and uh, search Vaishaya story of Afghanistan and in Vaish courses channel, this video will come out. Okay. So the Afghans uh, history, if you take, uh, uh, they never wanted to come under British rule. Okay. The British has always considered Afghanistan as a buffer, as a buffer uh, space because the India and Pakistan area, which is present Pakistan, that was very important for British. So the outside buffer area was Afghanistan. So anybody is coming to enter India, they will stop them at Afghanistan itself. Okay, and uh, despite that time, uh, several times the British are trying to control uh, fully the Afghanistan. The people there and the king there was not in agreement. The king Amanullah declared Afghanistan to be independent from British protection in August 19, 1919. Okay, and so from that day, it is considered as a Independence Day. There was a war also, Third Anglo-Afghan War, which I told you in Spectrum. I have told you, I have taught you First, Second, and Third Anglo War. After that, each treaties were there. Example, after the Third War. World, the third uh, Anglo-Afghan war, there was a Raval Pindi treaty and then they have become independent. Okay, so this is the first important or the most important thing of today, August 19, 2023. Okay, now other things which happened okay like today is world photography day and world humanitarian day so photography day because the french inventor uh, this person had uh, found or invented the earliest form of photography in 1837 okay the camera itself i think 1835 it was invented and then world humanitarian day that is uh, the bombing happened on un headquarters in the capital of iraq that is baghdad and uh, 2023 is uh, uh, a kind of that bombing anniversary okay to in commemorating that this day is uh, declared okay humanitarian are the people who work selflessly for others so uh, in their memory this day is being celebrated now uh, again your spectrum you would have studied uh, the Plassey war and the battle of Plassey and there uh, that time the Britishers started minting coin for the first time so that was again 19th August 1757 that the Bengal presidency or the Calcutta or now Kolkata uh, they minted the first ever rupee coin okay uh, that time actually the Bengal British sorry Bengal Madras and Bombay had minted coins separately and now uh, sorry in 1835 they had a unified coinage system and then it was uniform across the country okay so that is also importance of 19th August then the Bhuvaneshwar that is the capital of Orissa presently earlier it was Katak which was the capital so that replacement happened on August 19 1945 now science related in world uh, space if you take world's first geostationary satellite was launched by nasa on this particular day so what is geostationary satellite what is polar satellite what is all these things we have explained in our science and tech playlist you can go and watch that okay so syncom 3 the world's first geostationary satellite was launched on this particular day in 1964 now one more thing as uh, with respect to old ancient world history the first roman emperor the augustus caesar he died at the age of 76 on today's date august 19 in AD 14 okay so around four decades he was ruling and uh, he was succeeded by his stepson Tiberius okay so these are the important things which happened today and we have a huge compilation of all the current affairs which is needed for your UPSC exam and uh, this is individually put in 12 months 12 months back up to the like back date of five years so this will be useful for any kind of exam you are preparing okay uh, you, our daily editorials plus these things if you do your complete current affair will be easily solvable in any exam which comes okay and the same thing in the form of combo pack also we are giving that is the combination of pack 1 2 or 1 2 3 or 1 2 3 4 5 so like that 5 year 3 year and 2 year combos are there so if you are serious about preparation and if you want to get access to these just come and whatsapp and we'll tell you how to make the payment as per the offer price which is going on till this week and after that you can have access to it in your gmail okay and you can sit and print it or read it or download it it's your choice how to read it so this is the uh, current affair packs and then vaishaya's goodies which students asked we will announce it on october 2nd 2023 which most of the students will be getting free of cost if they are enrolled to our test series others can get it at the price which we will be listing in our website 
and then the test series 2024 batch 2 that is also available with one year timetable for this say uh, this thing same whatsapp number is given you can ask and uh, enroll quickly because we are going to close the enrollment of this also okay so i hope uh, everything was clear and i'll come up with the next editorial video today and one more video will come uh, so till then subscribe the channel and stay tuned thank you and have a nice day